subscribe my YouTube channel AWS and press the bell icon for never miss and other updates. Hello friends, welcome to this session. We are going to see the alarm in this session and uh, more, many of my uh, student and uh, many of have given the comments in my YouTube videos that they uh, want to understand the billing section for AWS as it looks critical and how to set the alarm for the billing. So in case uh, particular amount you will see and it will send a notification to you so you can take care of your billing. So let's try to understand the billing sections. So you can go to the billing here. I will search, but you can find here billing. So Amazon gives the billing service. So let's open the billing. So this is the billing dashboard and you will see the your bill summary here and you can see that the bill summary here of the spend summary and this is the month and day spent by service. So it will show the details for your uh, service which you have used. So as of now this uh, there is no uh, bill generated for me. So it will show here the, your exchange rates. So this is the exchange rate from uh, INR to USD. Uh, it will show your past billing here. So in July there is a no bill here, but in June there is a bill here. You can see here. Uh, for billing details, you can see click on Cost Explorer, but you can also click on the bill details for the uh, monthwise bill. So you can see the, what is your monthwise bill here. So I will going to click on uh, month March. So this is my bill details you can see here. Let me uh, click one more uh, so where we can um, see the different services which we have used. So in March, I hope in January. Okay, so you can see the details here. Bill. So here the six dollar is a bill details. Uh, this is summary. So you are paying summary, but which service you have used so in details it will show the elastic compute cloud that EC2 you use this is a different region you use this is the bill for your different region you have also used the elastic case so this is the elastic case bill so this is one dollar uh, you can see the details for your service use which you have used so I have used for T2 macro and uh, this is the 147 hertz so this is a completely free, but I have used the enhanced high memory R4 large node. I changed the node and this is the node charge of this is the $1.73. So you can see the details here uh, for your each uh, resource which you have used. Let's go back to the dashboard. Uh, let's click on cost exposure. So you will see the details here cost exposure so you can find your totally uh, deep, uh, details oriented your dashboard for your cost. So this is the last six months you can view um, your um, uh, last six month uses uh, you can see uh, and you can take preventing action so where uh, which service you are taking uh, more bill in terms of your uses. So in case you see the in if any reason you have deploy anything and that's not in use so you can delete immediately. So uh, this is the exposure. So let's go to the uh, alarm create. So how to create alarm. Let's try to understand alarm. So let's go to the uh, cloud watch for creating alarm. So in cloud watch you will see the billing section here and uh, here it will give the billing alarm and it is uh, you can create a 10 free alarm and 1000 free email notification each month so this will come in free tire so let's create a alarm here so if i want to create alarm when the, my uh, total bill is greater than 10 dollar and it will send notification to me so if i will give the notification email id so i will give notify at test.com this is my dummy email so you can see here so I will create alarm here so here you can see the alarm 
details so it will send email notification to your email just for verification and without verification it will not uh, uh, send to email notification to you so i just click the will do notification later but you, know, you have to give the valid email id for your notification uh, so as of now though there is a no sufficient data that's why it's not it will not trigger but still the confirmation is pending so this is the simple alarm setting you can create here uh, once the uh, billing details will be provided so as of so no bills generated here so it will not uh, show you the alarm and there is a zero bill uh, as of now in this current month so uh, it will not create so in billing you can create a 10 alarm different different so the there is a different matrix available for billing so you can estimation change by service you can create the different different uh, alarm here based on your requirement so friends this is the all about uh, billing and how to create alarm for specific um, uses of your AWS resource Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share, subscribe my channel and don't forget to click on bell icon for next upcoming video. Thank you.